Hello, I am Aaron, the designer of Battle Dice. This video will cover the basics on how to play, and the next video will show an example of a whole game played out. This game is designed for 2-7 players, and probably takes around 5 minutes per number of players. When you open the box, you should find one set of instructions, 3 small ability cheat sheets, 30 different white hero dice, and 7 black 10-sided dice. Each player gets a black die, and sets it in front of them with the zero side up. This represents and keeps track of your 10 health. Each time you take damage or heal, you turn your dice to show the current health face up. When your health is reduced to zero and you do not heal, you are eliminated. The last player alive wins. To battle, you must first select your team. Decide who goes first, then take turns choosing one hero until each player has three. This is your team. It is important to note that all 30 heroes have different combinations of abilities. There are 15 different abilities total, 5 offense, 5 defense, and 5 utility. The ability on the side that contains the hero's name is their signature move, and they have it duplicated on the back, thus increasing their probability to roll that ability. Choosing heroes that have complementary abilities is important to rolling combos, so when I explain each ability, you see if you can find any that work well together. When it is your turn to roll, you choose two of your three heroes to send into battle. All damage is always dealt to the player to your left. Swarm deals one damage, then set this die forward. You have the swarm effect active, allowing you to roll all three of your dice on your next turn. Growth, heal yourself for one. There is no healing past 10. Set this die forward to represent having the growth effect active, allowing you to roll all three of your dice on your next turn. Bash deals one damage, but will instead do three damage if the player you are attacking has an active effect, including Swarm, Growth, Shield, Ice, Focus, Meditate, or Poison. Shield. Set this die forward to represent the active shield effect. On the next attack you receive, block up to 3 damage. The shield and all other active effects only last one round, then go away, regardless of being used or not. Dark. Rolling one dark deals one damage. Rolling two at the same time deals a total of five damage, and rolling three dark at the same time deals 13 damage total. Fire. Deals two damage and ignores any active shields. Lightning deals one damage to start, then continue rolling this die until you roll something other than lightning. Deal damage equal to the number of consecutive lightnings rolled. Ignore the final non-lightning result. Light, heal yourself for one. If you roll two light, heal for four. If you roll three, heal for 10. Additionally, when rolling light, any healing value generated that would heal you past the maximum 10 health is converted to damage on your opponent. This includes healing from other dice. You must heal to 10 first, then convert the extra. Water. Heal yourself for 2. If you are currently at 0 health, heal for 3 instead. Curse. Deal 3 damage to your opponent and 1 damage to yourself. Poison. When a player is under the poison effect, the self-healing and damage they do is reversed. If they are poisoned and roll water, instead of healing for 2, they take 2 damage, etc. Meditate gives you the option to heal for 4. If you do, set this die forward as an active meditation effect. You may not roll this die next turn. If, however, you choose not to use the heal, it will be available for use next turn. Some examples of when you would choose not to use meditate and instead pass are if you are already full health, if you have a growth effect active and you would rather roll it again next turn, or if you are currently poisoned, you can bypass the 4 self damage. Ice. Deal 1 damage. Choose 1 die from a player to either your right or left. That hero is under the frozen effect and cannot be rolled on their next turn. All damage always goes left, even if you freeze a die to your right. Focus. Double the damage and healing of your other dice, or set this die forward as an active effect and double the value of your next roll. Rolling multiple focus doubles multiple times. 
Drain. Deal 1 damage and heal for 1. Drain has an additional bonus with focus. Instead of a symmetrical doubling, choose to either do 3 damage and 2 heal, or 2 damage and 3 heal. It might take a couple turns to learn what every ability does, so refer to your cheat sheet card for a reminder, or check your instructions for a more detailed explanation and examples of how abilities can be used. After several rounds of damaging and healing, a player will inevitably reach zero health. When that happens, they are knocked down and have one chance to revive. If they successfully roll a heal, they can stand up and continue fighting. However, each time they are knocked down, the heal required to revive increases by one. Example, if you have been knocked down three times, you must heal for three or more to revive. Failing to heal the required amount results in elimination. When a player successfully eliminates an opponent, they take one of the eliminated player's heroes to add to their own team. Having a larger team gives you more options, but you still only roll two dice per turn, or three with Swarm or Growth active. Rounds continue until there is only one player remaining. The last person standing claims victory as the battle master. Games can be quick, so be sure to try out some different team combinations and strategies. This was a limited production, so get your copy of Battle Dice while supplies last by following the link below. Good luck.